Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Mariel. I am so excited for this new chapter in my life, this new adventure I'm taking on. I have been meaning to do this for a while now. I'm not gonna say how long because I honestly can't even remember how long it's been since I've been trying to do this for myself, but here we are. It is the new year. Happy new year, guys. It is 2024. This is I don't know what it is about this year, but I just feel like this is the year. And honestly, a lot of us think that about every single year. And to be honest, that is a great way to go on about life. Any opportunity that we get, any chance that we get to start over or, I don't know, reinvent ourselves, try new things. There's never like the right moment. I am editing the video and I just noticed that for the first clip, the audio was corrupted. I'm not sure if it was a microphone or the camera. I don't know what happened, but basically I was telling you guys I was just getting ready for the new year and to embark on this new adventure with my channel. And obviously sometimes we need, you know, if it's the new year to start something, if we need that, then go ahead. If you can start it in the middle of the week, if you can start it at the end of the month, like you don't have to wait for the right moment to start something or to change something that you want to. Like you can start like late in the late at night on a Tuesday night. I don't know. Like you can start whenever, but for some people, if a Monday mornings new year new month whatever it is if that helps you get to the place that you want to like if you need that motivation or that moment to do so then go ahead for me in this case the new year worked out for me best and whatever it is I think you should take it and run with it that was basically the idea I was trying to convey here um, and then I told you guys that I was going to start my day and I went to the gym and did a few other stuff. So now we can get back into the vlog. It is a couple hours later. I'm gonna get ready right now because we have things to do. We have chores to do. I'm gonna do my makeup real quick because this is like the best time for me to sit down and talk to you guys, but also get ready because there's a few things that we have to get done. Chores and errands that we have to run. So let's get started. I'm gonna start with this primer now. I don't know if I'm the only one, but after the whole... COVID thing happened I stopped wearing makeup and it wasn't until this year well 2023 last year that I started getting back into it slowly but getting back into it like I actually enjoy doing my makeup again which is weird I haven't worn I haven't worn primer in such a long time I didn't own primer until last week that I was with my cousin and my sister they were talking about this primer and I was like you know what let me try it that was a lot was that a lot I'm not sure this is the elf primer I don't even know how to do this this is not a tutorial on how to do your makeup either by the way because um I don't know how to do that I'm in my office right now I am trying to use this space as well more often because I don't it's a great space that I have here but I usually don't use it I don't use it as much as I should next I'm gonna go with the wet and wild tinted hydrator I love this thing so much it is so cheap and I can't remember who I saw using this when it first came out and I haven't used anything else since I don't like heavy foundation, especially not for the everyday wear. I use this one as a daily foundation. It's kind of like a BB or CC cream. See, I don't know any of these terms. And it is 
amazing because it just covers like my redness it's not i mean you can build it up like it's not gonna give you a full face heavy makeup feeling it, you don't feel it at all it's hydrating i guess and i just love it because it just gives me an even tone and you don't need a lot next i'm gonna do my eyebrows i use this one right here it's from elf this is my favorite eyebrow pencil like if there's something that i didn't stop using was something for my eyebrows obviously i was supposed to chat with you guys but i honestly don't know how people can do this like how can they do like how can they do their eyebrows and talk like i need total concentration I wanted to do this and chat with you guys, but it is a bit difficult. We already did that. I'm going to go in with my bronzer. I've used this all my life. Like, I just bought another one because it is a Too Faced chocolate bronzer. I literally just bought another one because this one is gone. Like, gone. I have a new one, but I'm going to use the rest of it until I'm done with it because I love it so much. I use this for everything, like... All over my face my I use it as an eyeshadow my nose contour everything it just if there's a product that I need in my life it'll be this like, this is like the product I need to have every day all day at all times um but yeah I wanted to talk to you guys because it is it is a new year we all have goals that we want to hit this year I'm sure you guys all do i'm sure i do like i was telling you guys i think setting up goals for yourself is a is a great way to start the year rather than like not even thinking about the future or things that you want to do things that you want to accomplish i don't know i usually don't make a vision board i just tend to write down the things that i want to do my goals things like that i usually don't have like a visual thing but my sister made one this year and she was like, you know what, I made one last year and a few things happened. Maybe they don't happen in the exact same way that you think they will happen, but they happen one way or another. Like they're they have it's they have their own way into showing showing up in your life. So I was like, you know what? It won't hurt. If I make one, it won't hurt. Like it it won't. If nothing happens, nothing happens if the things happen they happen but it won't hurt at all like not even my feelings so i made one and i'm excited because i put it as my laptop background i never do that but i did it my ipad has it so you know a few things i'm excited for one of those things is just working on myself working on my time management i want to be selfish this year I want to literally just do the things that I love to do and I've been working on it for a few months already. I want to say since, again, since I thought about making this channel, starting this, this is something that I've always wanted to do but because this is not my first channel, this is my second channel actually. I mean, I do want to keep the other one. So yeah, this is not my first channel. I wasn't sure if I wanted to keep my other channel i wasn't sure if i just wanted to work on the other channel or create this one at the end of the day i decided to create this one and work on this one as well but i am keeping the other channel just because that channel is more of like a i've always wanted to do this but i had to find like my niche i had to find like something specific that i wanted to do for a channel that's like a story for another time but the thing is that I've always wanted to just share things that I like to do. I like to do a lot of things. I like to be creative. I don't want to put myself into just like one specific thing. I want to show you guys things that I like to do. I love to learn. Something that I find fascinating is the fact that you never stop learning. You should never stop learning. I'm the type of person that likes to learn about process or like anything in general i want to know how it starts the process of it and the final product final whatever it is like i will ask questions because it's fascinating to know everything i don't know how to explain it i bought this elf blush it's in the color 
blushing. I have another one of these, but it is super pink, like so pink, but I like it. Okay, so this one's not for me because I can't even see the color. Let me get the other one. I'm going to use my other one that I have that it got discontinued and I don't know what I'm going to do with my life because I love this blush so much. It's a flower. It's a flower brand by Drew Barrymore, I believe. Um, it's discontinued. I don't think she has a brand anymore. Um, but anyways, I was telling you guys, I just like to learn. I like to ask questions and everything. So, um... Where I'm going with this is that I like to do things, I like to be creative, I like to learn. I am a horrible teacher and that is exactly why I was telling you that I'm not, this is not me teaching you how to do your makeup at all. This is just me doing my makeup. Like, I just want to show you guys the things that I do, not necessarily teach you guys how to do things Um, because I like to be creative. I love watching people decorate their homes. I like to watch people do their makeup. I just like to watch other people's lifestyles and see what works for me. So that is pretty much what I want to do with this because I am excited. I've always wanted to do this. There's a lot of things that I want to do and I would love to bring you guys along with me on the ride, the journey, whatever you want to call it. I just don't want to choose one thing to do because I like to do a lot of things. Right now, my job, like my actual job, doesn't allow me to be very creative. And I have been struggling with that for about a year. Now, I like my job. I like what I do. And it pays the bills, you know, like it keeps me afloat. I am very happy with having that. But I also do want to work on myself and I want to learn new things I don't want to feel stuck or be stuck anymore and that is my purpose this year I just want to be selfish and I want to work on myself I want to grow again because I was feeling very very stuck for the last year and a half I had never felt this stuck in such a long time and you know if you're not comfortable we have to do things. We have to figure things out, see what works for us, and try to try new things. And that is exactly what I'm going to be doing this year for myself. So here we are. My cousin came to visit during the holidays from Mexico, and she brought me a few mascaras from over there because I love mascaras from Mexico. This is the brand. Um, I like to use the pink one, this one right here. No, that's not the one. Where is it? This is my favorite one. Obviously, this one's gone empty. And I asked her to get me more. And she brought, she got me the, the right one. But she got a few more. And I just love them so much. They act, they are oil-based. But I kid you not, they help my eyelashes grow. I had no eyelashes before. And this one is lovely i need to use waterproof mascara if i don't use this kind and obviously this one's work amazing honestly that is all i do for my makeup like on a daily basis sometimes even less um i don't even wear mascara for work anymore i just keep it simple so i just need my lips i was gonna use this nyx oil it is like in the cherry thing but my cousin, we went to buy makeup and she told me about this benefit tint. I guess this is like trending right now. I'm not sure. I don't know anything about makeup these days. I'm just trying things out. I tried it the other day and I don't like the taste or the smell. It smells like roses. It's supposed to smell like roses and all that stuff. It smells and tastes like roses, but it's not my favorite. It's cold. It's really cold. I saw someone add more in the middle. I don't know about this, guys. That doesn't look good. I don't know about it. I'm not too convinced, but it is what it is. We already have it. I'm going to put earrings, and I need to fix my hair. 
and we have to head out. We are gonna run some errands today. We are going to Costco. We have to get food and a few th other things um, that we need. We are also going to clean downstairs because it is a mess and I still have Christmas up that also has to go down. So that is the plan for today. Again, this would have been my Sunday reset, but because I have other plans for tomorrow, I have to do it today. I'm just trying to get as much done today as I can so tomorrow I can rest. That was the makeup and the chat. Let's fix the hair and head out to Costco. For my hair, because I didn't wash it, I threw it up on a half ponytail and then I have this black bow that I added. Um, I don't know if you guys can tell if I do this. Um, hopefully I got it. I've always loved wearing bows. Like all the fun stuff for hair, I've always loved that stuff. So I'm excited that everyone is getting on that trend right now because it's so cute. I don't know why anyone wouldn't want to wear a bow in their head. Just saying, that's just me. It's also a very rainy day today. That's why the light keeps changing and I love rainy days. My favorite days are cold and rainy days. You guys will learn that along the way. I'm pretty much ready, I just need shoes and we can get going. We got home a few hours ago, but we got straight into cleaning the kitchen because it was such a mess. Like you guys have no idea. I had to clean the fridge, it was it was a mess. We had to take things out. It is a new year, so nothing that expired or that went bad or that we were not going to eat. I didn't want any of that in my fridge for this week. Um, we're basically also just, we just got groceries for the week, like things that we're going to eat and meals that we're going to have during the week just to make sure that just, like we don't leave things there. We clean that. We are almost done with the kitchen. It's gonna be clean by the end of the day. I lost another nail in the process, but we're gonna take care of that tomorrow. Don't you worry. I have to do something about them. These are my Christmas nails. My nails are for tomorrow. I'm gonna go downstairs right now. We're gonna finish cleaning the kitchen, and then we're gonna tackle another little thing that we have to tackle. Let's go downstairs. This is the next thing that I want to tackle today. I want to get my Christmas stuff down because I still haven't done that. And I'll tell you guys why. Give me a second. If you guys can hear that, that's the dishwasher in the back. I'm sorry, it's super loud. But what I wanted to tell you guys is that the reason why I have my Christmas decoration up until January 6th, I always take them down after January 6th. And that's because today is Dia de los Reyes and that is a very special holiday for me and my family, especially me. I just like held on to the tradition. Um, growing up, los Reyes were the ones that brought us gifts. I didn't grow up with Santas and most of the years I tried to get something for my family, just something little for Dia de los Reyes and then we obviously we get a rosca and we gather so we cut it and all that stuff. My family was supposed to come today and things didn't work out. We have a rosca that we're going to cut later tonight, but I want to get all this stuff down already since like my family's not coming. So I'm going to make hot chocolate and we're going to cut the rosca. Hopefully I get the baby, <laughs> la niño Dios. That way it's going to be like, if you get it, the idea is that you have a very lucky year. And you're supposed to want to get it even though the joke is like you don't want to get it but the thing is that you should want to get it because it's supposed to help you out and it's 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 a good luck charm for the whole year this is going down today I want to do it before 8 p.m. I don't have a lot of stuff so I think I'm gonna be able to so let's get that going so I can sit down have rosca and hot chocolate I know I'm yellow it's the light. It's fine. I'm gonna get started, but I didn't watch a lot of Christmas movies. I actually didn't watch any Christmas movies except for like the whole Santa Claus. All the movies and then all the series that have come out. So I'm gonna watch Sleepless. No. So I'm gonna watch While You Were Sleeping with Sandra Bullock and the other guy because this is such a good movie. I was looking for the Polar Express, but they, they're not streaming it anywhere like 
I have to rent it from Amazon. So I'm just gonna watch while you were sleeping, while I clean, I mean, while we clean this up. It's gonna be a great time. Cleaning up the Christmas stuff took longer than I thought. I honestly thought it wouldn't take longer than 40 minutes. What was that, like an hour and a half? Hour and 40. No. It started like at eight. It was 8.20. No, it was 7.20 no, when we started and then we finished like at nine. Anyways, it took longer my battery's gonna die just finished making the hot chocolate and i want to show you guys the let me see the rosca before the, my my battery dies we picked it up this morning by the way um i think i showed you guys earlier here it is let me turn you guys around it's not a big one i mean this is supposed to be a large but i think it's the best it's a great size so we're gonna cut it up right now and let's see who gets the baby it smells so good cut whatever you want you choose the piece you want to cut oh we're eating a big piece oh yeah all right we'll see what i get we can find out when we eat it it's i okay. thought that's what we were gonna do or i mean you can but they won't know. Yeah, it's really Oh. If you uncover it as well, it's also yours. <laughs> I see nothing. Okay. How many, did she say how many we have? No. I mean, the whole thing is ours, so somehow uh we're gonna get the baby either way mm -hmm. no one got it right now but this whole thing is for us so we technically will get it eventually. eventually and we don't know how many babies they added to it sometimes they add three sometimes they add two i'm not sure i'm thinking this one has two Probably. but we'll find out you guys my camera died so i'm on my phone but i ended up getting the baby like it was in there somewhere and I almost I almost ate it but obviously it was big enough I got it just thought I'd show you guys are you getting more I'll be lucky for the whole year good morning guys it is the next day I have a few errands to run again today with my sister so I'm heading out I'm gonna leave the vlog right here I think I got a lot of stuff yesterday I don't want to make this longer than it should like by all means I want to keep them short and sweet with that being said thank you guys so much for watching if you guys stuck to the end I appreciate you guys so much this is a new beginning for me I'm really excited for this year and I hope you guys are too I hope you guys write down your goals lots of good things coming this year I swear I hope everyone is having a great start to the year and that is all for this vlog. I will see you guys very, very soon.